Before connecting an M.2 drive to the M.2 backplane, ensure that the blue retainer is located on the section of the backplane to accommodate the drive. Press both sides of the retainer, then move the retainer forward until it is in the large opening of the keyhole. Remove the retainer from the keyhole. Insert the retainer into the correct keyhole and slide it backwards until it is secure, but not in the way for the installation of the M.2 drive. Insert the M.2 drive at an angle of approximately 30 degrees into the M.2 backplane connector. Note, if your M.2 backplane supports two M.2 drives, insert the drives into the connectors at both sides. Rotate the M.2 drive down until it is parallel with the backplane. Slide the retainer forward onto the notch of the M.2 drive to secure the drive in place. Grasp the assembly by the blue touchpoint tabs and align the blue plastic supports with the guide pins on the system board. Then insert the M.2 backplane into the M.2 slot on the system board. Carefully press down by the edges to seat it. Install the riser into the I.O. tray and then press the riser into the I.O. tray until the connector is fully seated by pressing down on the blue touch points. Tighten the two captive screws that secure the riser to the I.O. tray board. If any of the adapters in the I.O. tray have internal cables, make sure that they are connected before installing the I.O. tray. Align the I.O. tray with its opening in the rear of the chassis and insert 